got, I got, hello, hello, hello. You hear me? Nice and clear. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Do you hear me nice and clear, Rosa? Yes? Yes. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. Nice to see you one more time. How are you? Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Hello, hello, people. Good evening, nice. teacher. Thank you so much for being here. It's nice to it's nice to have you one more time. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just give me a minute so I can get um the attendance and also I can get um the material that we're gonna discuss today. Okay, so just give me some time. Sorry about it. Uh, I think it's this one. Oh my gosh. Give me a minute because I'm leading with something here. This is class number eight, as you may know. And as far as I remember, we're going to finish uh, section number four today. So it's nice to have you. Yes, yes. Thank you, Doki. Check the attendance. Okay, here we go. Give me a minute, please. I'm sorry. It's okay, Yuri. You much? Thank you so much for being here, people. It's nice to have you one more time. Uh, what is this one? Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? Fine. Well, oh, sounds good. Thank you. Um, okay. Thank you so much for being here. Oh my gosh, again? A minute, please. It doesn't, it doesn't allow me to do this. Okay. Thank you so much for being here, people. Welcome. Okay. Here we go. This is good. I think we're going to work today. Okay. We have section number number three. You can miss it. We're going to work with directions. Uh, this is beginners module number three. And this is class number eight. So thank you so much for being here. And we hope everybody is okay at home. Happy and ready to keep uh, learning this thing that is good English. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Nice to have you one more time. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. Right? Beautiful. Day. Si les gusta la music, right? One suggestion is like, cante la music in English, right? That will help you. And tell the music, right? So you have a favorite song, listen and sing. You know, so you can you can practice as much as you can. Yep. Let me check the chat. Somebody wrote in the chat. Uh, Ana Leticia. Okay, Ana Leticia. No problem. Enterado. Thank you so much for letting me know. Kidoki. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, people. Let's begin. Voy a tomar la attendance list. When you hear your beautiful name, say, hey, no, I'm here. Aleida. Thank you, teacher. Good evening. Thank you so much. Welcome. And it's nice to have you. Welcome, welcome. Alicia Alejandra Perez. Alicia? No. Okay. She's not here. Ana Cristina Osorio Cornejo. Present. Thank you so much and welcome. Um, what was that person? Hmm. Okay. And um, okay. Ahorita le tomo asistencia. Okay. Thank you so much. Ya ya vi en el chat que tienen inconvenientes with your um internet. No problem. Okay. With your internet connection. Ana Elizabeth Campos Romero. 
Present teacher. Good Thank evening. Thank you and good evening. Welcome. Blanca Mendoza Hernández. Blanca. Hello, Blanca. Blanca. No, she didn't. What about Cristian Ernesto Romero Aquino? Present teacher. Thank you and welcome, Cristian. Nice to have you. Maricela Perez. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Maricela. Welcome. Nice to have you. Milagro Granados Rodriguez. So, Milagro? No, she is. Isabel Zuniga de Orellana. A ver. No. No se dice. Vale. What about Ernesto Arias? Ernesto Arias. No. Mira aquí. What about Fátima Hernández? Present teacher. Thank you so much, Fátima. Welcome. Y Jessica Romero González. Present teacher. Thank you so much. And Jessica Terran, well, Melanie, right? That's Melanie. Okay, I missed a lot, right, Melanie? Thank you. Juan Carlos Lopez. Present. Thank you so much and welcome. Julio Cesar Tomar. Present teacher. Good evening. Thank you so much. Good evening. Welcome. Miguel Rodriguez Sanchez. Present. Thank you so much, Miguel. Nice to have you. Eh, Nubia Daisy Ramirez de Serrano. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Good evening. Nice to have you. Rosa Salazar de Fabian. Present, teacher. Thank you and welcome. Eh, Eunice Ruiz Morales. Present, teacher. Thank you, Eunice. Welcome. Nice to have you. And Jennifer Flores. Present teacher. Thank you so much. And Yolanda Andrade de Rodas. Present. Thank you. Present. Yolanda. Good evening. Nice to have you. We are the chat. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. Right? Uh -huh. Teacher, no. Evening, Mrs. Nelson. Milagro, ahorita milagro, solo de un minuto. Me da minutes. Que me da minutes. Here we go. Yes. Present. Thank you so much, milagro. Ya le tomé la asistencia. Okay. Thank you. Perfect. Okay, people. Let's carry on with this thing. Direction. That is the one we're going to work today. Let's take a look at this thing. Okay. Oh my gosh. Tenemos. New York City, there is attraction, okay? This is what we have, okay? Let's listen and practice. ¿Qué va a hacer usted? Escucha and repeat. Thank you. Teacher, no se escucha. No se escucha nada, teacher. Thank you so much. Mire cómo le hicieron. Así tiene que decir. Mire, hey. No listen, teacher. It's very good. Yeah, tell me. Mire, señor. Okay. No le escucha nada, right? Very good. Yeah. Good. I'm sorry. Okay. I apologize. Page 89. Exercise 7. Snapshot. Listen. And practice. New York City's tourist attractions. The Empire State Building. Brooklyn Bridge. Central Park. Times Square. Rockefeller Center. The Statue of Liberty. 
Okay. Miguel Rodriguez, please say these places. Thank you so much. The Empire State Building. Building. Yeah, carry on. Continue, please. Carry on. Brooklyn Bridge, Central Park, Times Square, Rockefeller Center, the State of Liberty. A statue, statue of liberty. Very okay. good, Miguel. Perfect. Okay. So when you go to New York, Miguel, okay, next time, when you stay by, right? When you when you when you go to New York, you can visit these places, right? Piense siempre positive, que todo se le va a venir, right? Right, see? Su meta es in New York, you will do it, okay? You will do it. So, when you stay in New York, don't forget you have these places that you can visit, right? Yes. Uh, we have these beautiful places here. Julio, what do you know about these places, Julio? Tell me, please. Empire State Building, uh, Brooklyn Bright Central Park, Times Square, Rockefeller Center, the Statue of Library. Very good. Okay. Very good. Now, what do you know? ¿Qué sabe? What do you know about, o qué conoce, right? What do you know about these places? Mm -hmm. Um... <laughs> no, <laughs> like, what are you, like, what is it? No, it is about, like, it doesn't matter, porque yo tampoco estaba in New York, right? In esos places, right? So it's like, I mean, what do you know about them? Like, did you, did you see them in a movie? Or, like, do you, did you see them in a, in a magazine? Or something like that? Uh-huh. The magazine. Oh, okay, okay. Or in movies, right? For example, Julio, está viendo una movie que se llama X Men, X Men One. Y ahí sale esta Statue of Liberty, Liberty, right? Esta escena donde ellos they fight, una pelea, y es aquí en esta Statue of Liberty, right? So, cuando le preguntan a usted, what do you know about something? Tampoco es que usted, pues, uh, lo haya vivido o, o lo, esté ahí, right? Sino que se refiere, pues, algo que usted sepa que haya escuchado, right? O ya sea, lo haya visto, o lo haya, like, read, o, o le hayan contado, right? Maybe uh, eh, Rosa nos contó, right? Cuando fue a New York, right, Rosa? Yes. Yes, right. teacher. <laughs> yes, right? Sí, entonces. En movies. Ajá, uh -huh. yes, en las movies. For example. <laughs> Yo lo yes. conocí, mi pobre angelito. Oh, yes, Christian, that is correct, right? Mi, uh, mi pobre angelito. It's home Alone. Home Alone, the movie, ahí tenemos some places, right? Some places. Like the Rockefeller Center, creo que lo tenemos en mi pobre angelito, right? The Rockefeller Center, we have it. Right? Yes, Central Park también. Central Park, exactly. Fire State, parece también. Oh, the first day? Oh, my gosh, that's good. That's good. Yes. Very good. La Milagro, Granados, question for you. What makes them popular? What, what, what makes them popular? Mm -hmm. uh, Brooklyn Bridge. Okay, popular. Do you understand popular? Um, Los Angeles. No, la palabra popular, ¿entiendes esta palabra? Popular. Ah, um, Le voy a mencionar a alguien que es pop popular. For example, uh, la niña Jani. ¿Conoce la niña Jani? Right? Ah, sí, sí. She's very popular, right? She's popular. Okay, yes. Entonces, estos places, what makes them popular? Hmm? Um, the Statue of Liberty. Uh -huh. Okay, pero ¿qué los hace? What makes them popular? ¿Qué los hace popular? Statue of Liberty, creo que es popular en todas las películas, casi todas salen. 
Y es eso. So we Por ejemplo, can watch... la de el día después de mañana sale. In movies, right? Yes. Yeah, so we have the Statue of Liberty mm -hmm. in movies. Very good, Christian. That is correct. In, right? in Titanic, too. Titanic as well, right? Yes, very good. Very it's good. in Hollywood. Yes. Son muy visitadas también, teacher. Exactly. Right? So, exactly. So, like, a lot of people visit these places, right? Visit these places. ¿Y, y por qué yes. lo visitan, visit, right? Visit, visit, visit. Exactly, right? Exactly, right? Very young good. Obsequio, parece esa. Oh, that's true. That's true, Christian. That's right. Yeah. La otra es, what are some popular tourist attractions in our country? Okay, now this is about our country, El Salvador. ¿Conocen usted algún tourist attraction that is very popular? Popular, popular, correct? Right? Popular in El Salvador. Salvador del Mundo. Okay. Yes. Salvador del Mundo, very good. El nacional. The museum, the National Museum, El Tunco Beach, right? Yes. National, National Museum. Museum. Very good. The National Museum. Bueno, no tenemos un. Bueno, ¿dónde está Sunset National Park. Museum? Oh. Sunset Park ahora. National. <laughs> Sunset Park. Los tacos que venden en por el Donde Más Ferrer. <laughs> Los mataniños. Los de Lux. Estoy en el centro de la del del sal, de San Salvador, teacher. Oh, downtown, downtown. Right? Yes, downtown. 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 Planes downtown. de renderos. Planes de renderos, maybe, yes, that's right. Sí, pero la puerta del diablo mm -hmm. es close. La puerta del diablo es close. Entonces, mm -hmm. um, pues, la ruta de las flores, teacher. Exactly, right? La ruta de las flores. That's sí. okay. Sur City. Sur City. Sur City. Sur City, right? Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Hola. Very good. So, uh, let's say, Blanca, ayúdeme. Si usted le recomienda un tourist um, uh, que venga aquí a Salvador y le va a recomendar five places, ¿cuáles serían those five, five attractions? I recommend. Um, Planet Rendero, I recommend. Colocuita. Parque Cuscatlán, recommend. El Tunco, recommend. Eh, eh, volcán, eh, Volcán de Isalco. Isalco Volcán. Yo recommend. Eh, Uh, yes, very good. Also, Miguel was talking about something that is, for me, is the best place to eat pupusas. In El Salvador, there is only one place to eat pupusas, which is um, Olocuilta. Ahí, believe me, like, no he encontrado pupusas, like, more delicious than in Olocuilta. Okay, Olocuilta, they have the best, the best pupusas ever. Yeah. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. Uh, no, 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 Creo que es en Salvador o La Paz, I guess. En Salvador o La Paz, but... Paz, 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 La Paz. La Paz, yes. Tú They have the best el, el museo. Uh -huh. Tú visitas el museo de armas y la cuadra mexical y todo eso es pupusas. Oh, yes, that Hasta is true. La... Calle México, right? Yes. yes. No? Calle México, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Calle México, we have a bunch of pupuserías, mm -hmm. that's right. Ah, yeah, yes. But, yes. but Blanca, yes. believe me, believe me. O lo cuenta. Is the best. Lo cuenta es like. No like. <laughs> <You don't> like. <laughs> yeah. The weather is nice. Lo cuenta, the weather is nice. Okay, let's continue. Page. Working with this conversation. Okay, we're it's gonna have good. this conversation. Let's listen. Okay, and then we will practice.
Page 89. Exercise 8. Conversation. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Listen and practice. Excuse me, sir. Can you help me? How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Just walk up 6th Avenue to 49th Street. Rockefeller Center is on the right. Is it near Radio City Music Hall? Yes, it's right across from Radio City Music Hall. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Page 89. Exercise 8. Conversation. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Listen and practice. Excuse me, sir. Can you help me? How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Just walk up 6th Avenue to 49th Street. Rockefeller Center is on the right. Is it near Radio City Music Hall? Yes, it's right across from Radio City Music Hall. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Thank you so much. Thank you. Milagro Granados, tell me, where are they in the picture? Where are they? What is the place? Is this San Salvador? Is this Santo Tomás? Is this San Miguel? Mm -hmm. San Where Salvador. are <laughs> No, no. Look at this. Look at this building here. Do you remember this building? Yeah. The Empire State. The Empire State Building. So, what is the area? What is the area? La segunda canción hicieron JC y Alicia Keys. New York City. New York City, right? New York. This is. They are. Okay, Milagro. They are in New York City. Repeat, please. They are in New York City. Very good, ok, very good Entonces, ¿qué le recomiendo yo? Cada que usted dice un lugar Usted tiene que practicar y dice I am in I am in Y dice el lugar, right? At, in el Tunco Beach I am in the church I am in, um, I, am in um, I am in Oloquilta I am in eh, Planes de Renderos Right? Okay. Very okay. So, tenemos esta conversación. Vamos a practicar en los breaker rooms. Les voy a pedir que le tomen una captura, please. Thank you. Yes, take it. Tómenle captura, please. Y vamos a practicar en los breaker rooms. Excuse me, sir. Can I help you? How do I get to the Rockefeller Center? Just walk up 6 Avenue, 49th Street. Rockefeller Center is in the right. Okay. Voy a abrir los breaker rooms. So you can practice. But we read the tres, so you can um, do it. Some of you will be here in the main room, okay? See? Some of you will be here in the main room, okay? And ya le puedo decir quiénes van a estar here. Okay, just give me a minute. See? Okay, ahí está. Quiero ver cuántos minutes. Okay. En el main room se va a quedar Alba Milagro Granados. Uh, perdón, Elba Milagro Granados, Juan Carlos López Linares, and Nubia Daisy Ramirez. You three stay here in the main room. Yes? Sí, no vayan a aceptar. Cuando les llegue la pop-up message, no acepten. Milagro Granados Rodríguez, Juan Carlos López, and Nubia Daisy Ramirez. You stay in the main room. Los demás, please, acepten la invitación. Join with your partners so you can practice this conversation. Ready? Bien. So, Ana, perdón, Ana, usted tiene problemas de internet, right? Okay. Yes, very good. Ana Cristina. Ana Cristina, please join. 
Christian Romero. Jessica, please. Ana Cristina, necesito que se una with your partner so you can practice. Ana Cristina Osorio, ¿puede? Yes. Yes or no? Me aviso si no puede. Ok, very good. So los que mencioné, que van aquí en el main room, este es your time so you can practice the conversation. Okay? Yeah? Very good. Thank you so much. Hello, hello, people. Yolanda, how are you? Hello. Okay, let's practice with Rosa, okay? Okay. Yes. Uh, excuse me, sir, can you help me? How do you get a Rockefeller Center? You have Fifth Avenue to Fortnite Street. Rockefeller Center is on the drive. Is it near Re Hello, Daisy. Hello. ¿Cómo está? Ya Sí, vaya, eh, lo que pasa es, es que no tenía que unirse al grupo. La voy a enviar a la sala principal porque usted tenía que quedarse en la sala principal, ¿ok? Está bien. Perfecto, solo denme un minutito. Thank you so much. Behind you. Just turn around and look up. Um, y Alicia, no sé si puede. Alicia, no Nubia is going to join soon, so just just give her some some time. Teacher, yo tuve problemas para entrar en la en la sala. Oh, okay, so you can practice with them here, okay? Aquí en este grupo. Sí. Yes, yes. Okay. Eh, no sé cómo están haciendo. Acabamos de participar, eh, Juan Carlos. Hola. Hola. Si quieres lo que podemos hacer es leer una cosa. I had. Just go up Sixth Avenue in the 49th Street. Rockefeller Center is on the right. It is near Rios City Music Hall. Yes, it's right across from Radio City Music Hall. Thank you. And where is the Emperor State Building? It's it is far from here. It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay, perfect. Mm. Si gusta, Miguel, ayúdele a la compañera para que ella haga el, el azul y usted hace el... el, 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 el ajá, exacto, para, okay. para que ella esté Voy a empezar. Entonces, excuse me, sir. Can you help me? How do you... I get to Rockefeller Center? You were at 6th Avenue to, to 49th Street. Rockefeller Center is on the right. Is it near... Radio City Music Hall. Yes, it is right across from Radio City Music Hall. Thank you. And where where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. You turn around and look and look up. Creo que terminamos, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, creo que los, do, eh, todos, los tres hicimos los dos personajes, ¿verdad? Tres. Uh, it's right be behind you. Just turn around and look up. ¿Empiezo yo? Bye. Uh -huh. Ok. Excuse me, sir. Can you help me? 
How do you how do I get to Rockefeller Center? Just walk up Sixth Avenue, uh, 49 Street, Rockefeller Center is on the right. Is it in Radio City Music Hall? Yes, it's right across from Radio City Music Hall. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right paying, no, it's right be, behind, behind. behind you. Yes, yeah. <laughs> thank you. That was very nice of you. Thank you so much for sharing that. Okay, and again, remember, like, you can hear your classmates, the way they pronounce, like, the different phrases and the different words. So you can, like, oh, you say, oh, this is the way we, we can do it, right? Very good. Thank you so much for sharing, and also thank you so much for being nice with your classmates, okay? Always be nice, right? Always be nice. Thank you so much. We're going to get a little bit of the grammar content here, which is following. Pay this video i want you to watch this video listen and let's take a look of this grammar content hi everyone in this class you'll learn how to ask for and give directions additionally you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting let's get started by listening to a conversation title is it far from here let's listen and practice. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk up 5th Avenue to 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. We're going to practice giving directions now. Let's practice these phrases and vocabulary to give directions. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Walk up Fifth Avenue. Go up Fifth Avenue. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. How can I get to Bryant Park? Walk down Fifth Avenue. Go down 5th Avenue. Turn right on 42nd Street. It's on the left. So, let me summarize the vocabulary we must learn. Four questions. How do I get to? And we mention a place. Or, how can I get to? Then we mention a place. Four answers. Walk up. Go up. Walk down, go down, turn left on, turn right on, on the right, on the left. Make sure you memorize this vocabulary as it will be essential to ask for and give directions. Now, let's try to analyze the expressions walk up or go up. The first thing we want to do when giving directions is to have a departing point. Where are you located and where do you want to go? Let's say that we are at the Empire State Building and we have a question like the example shows. How do I get to Rockefeller Center or how can I get to Rockefeller Center? The first instruction would be walk up Fifth Avenue or go up Fifth Avenue. Now let's pretend that we are at 42nd Street and Madison Avenue and we want to get to St. Patrick's Cathedral. The question would be how do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral or how can I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? 
The first instruction would be walk up Madison Avenue or go up Madison Avenue. Now, let's pretend we are at St. Patrick's Cathedral and we want to get to New York Public Library. The question would be, how do I get to New York Public Library? Or, how can I get to New York Public Library? The first instruction would be, walk down 5th Avenue or go down 5th Avenue. So what is the next step to get to New York Public Library? For that, we will use the vocabulary, turn right on or turn left on, depending on where our destination is. So to answer that question, we will say, turn right on 42nd Street. So what is the last step after turning right on 42nd Street? For that, we will use the vocabulary on the right or on the left. So in this case, it's on the left. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to give directions using this map. Also, try to give directions to your local supermarket, hospital, school, park, etc. Hi everyone. In this we have the typical question, right? How do I get to? Or how can I get to? These are the two questions that we can ask or podemos recibir de alguien, right? How do I get to? Or how can I get to? Y luego decimos el lugar, right? Yes. Estas son las two questions para pedir directions. O podemos escuchar, pues, que nos digan no, dónde está. Right? Y teníamos algunas preposition of place or prepositions of location, like go up or walk out, uh, walk down, go down, to left on, to right on. O podemos decir la típica expression, it's on the right or it's on the left. Ok, mm -hmm. hemos venido practicing. Um, some directions about this one. Y pues, vamos a continuar doing so. So just give me a minute because I need to get the presentation. It's this one. A minute. So I'm sorry. This one. Okay. Okay. Here we have it. We have these dialogues. If you see the map here, okay, we have some some places, right? Yes, right. Uh, what are the places that we have here in this map, Juan Carlos? Tell me, please. Tell me the places that you see in this map, Juan Carlos Lopez. Excuse me. Please. Yes. Tell me the places that you see in the map. Train mm -hmm. station. Mm -hmm, very good. Bank. Yeah. Police station. Very good. Hotel. Yes. Bookstore. Thank you. And tell me the streets, please. The streets. Apple Street. Mm -hmm. Second Avenue. Perfect. Main Street. Wonderful. First Avenue. Was good. Thank you. So vamos a empezar desde acá, mire. Yeah. This is the point. And we have this conversation, okay? We are putting an audio and then we can practice. So put the game audio here. Excuse me, yes. How to get to the post office? Go past the hotel and turn left onto Main Street. Go one block and turn right. It's across from the train station. Thank you. One more time. Excuse me. Yes? How to get to the post office? Go past the hotel and turn left onto Main Street. Go one block and turn right. It's across from the train station. 
Thank you. Thank you. So where is this person going? Where is this person going? Mm -hmm. Where is this play this person going? A donde va this person? Yeah. Where is this person going? The post office. Post office. To the post office, right? To the post office. Very good, right? Entonces, right, si usted se fija, mire, le dan instructions. Just go past the hotel. Tengo yo, right? Just go y paso el hotel, right? Y luego me dice, turn left onto Main Street. Onto, right? Here. Yes. Yeah. Onto Main Street. Go one block. Okay. Acuérdese que one block es un... ¿Qué es un, una one, es un block? Como una cuadra. Una cuadra, very good. One block is one cuadra, right? Entonces vengo yo, one block, empiezo a cambiar la remada. <laughs> so, y luego dice, and turn right. Entonces voy a la derecha, right? Turn right. Y luego dice, it's across from the train station. Ok. Entonces aquí está. Train station. Luego, uh, ¿a dónde está la post office? ¿A dónde está la post office? Yes. A. Letter A. Right, exacto. Sería la letter A. Yes. La letter A. Aquí voy a llegar. Right. Ok, voy a poner el audio one more time. Thank you. Excuse me. Yes. How to get to the post office? Go past the hotel and turn left on to Main Street. Go one block and turn right. It's across from the train station. Very good. So we're going to work with Miguel and also you, Julio. Julio, you are going to be letter A, and Miguel, you are letter B. Y luego cambia el rol. Ready? Let's begin. Excuse me. Yes. How do you I get to the post office? Go past the hotel and turn left onto Main Street. Go one block and turn right. It's across from the train station. Thank you. Excuse me. Yes. How do I get to the post office? Go past the hotel and turn left. On Main Street, go one block and um, to right. It's across from the train station. Thank you. Thank you so much. Very good. Okay. Onto, esta palabra que está acá es un preposition of location or place, right? Es final significa en Spanish sobre. Okay. Yes. That's onto, fine. teacher. Yes, onto. Es otra prepositional oh. place that we can use cuando oh. tenemos calles, ¿ok? Aquí también podemos utilizar, ¿se acuerdan lo que estábamos ocupando? On. Turn left on Main Street, ¿ok? También podemos utilizar esto, ¿ok? Yep. So, on to, es como que está diciendo on. ¿Ya? Yeah? Es lo mismo. Es the same. <laughs> esta es más larga y esta es más corta, ¿right? Perfect, guys. Thank you so much. Quiero como... Thank you. Vamos con el next one, okay? Thank you. I will play the audio three times. So let's listen. Excuse me. How do we get to this market? Excuse. It's easy. Turn off Excuse me. Apple Street. Go yes. one block. The supermarket's on the corner of First Avenue and Apple Street, next to the police station. Thanks. How do we get to this market? It's easy. Turn left to the corner onto Apple Street. Go one block. The supermarket's on the corner of First Avenue and Apple Street. Next to the police station. Thanks. How do we get to this market? It's easy. Turn left to the corner onto Apple Street. Go one block. The supermarket's on the corner of First Avenue and Apple Street. Next to the police station. Thanks. 
So where where is this person going? Where is this person going? Mm -hmm. The supermarket. The <laughs> supermarket. Very good. What is the letter? A, B, or C? C. Excuse me? C. C. Letter C, right? Charlie. Very good. Thank you. Juan Carlos. And Blanca. Juan Carlos, you are going to be letter B. And Blanca, you are going to be letter A. Letter A. Y luego you change words. Ready? Let's begin. Blanca, usted comienza, please. Your mic is off, Blanca. Okay, okay. How do I get to the supermarket? It's easy. Turn left at the corner onto Apple Street. Go one block. The supermarket is on the corner of First Avenue and Apple Street, next to the police station. Thanks. How do you, right. how do I get to the supermarket? It's easy. To left at the corner on top of the street, go home block the supermarket, on the corner of First Avenue and Apple Street, next to the police station. Okay. Thank you so much. Very good. Great job. Okay. Oh my gosh. What's going on here? This one is, okay? Let's listen. Yes, no. Excuse me, how to get to the restaurant? Go straight past the bookstore in the hotel, turn left onto Main Street. It's the second building on the left, between the hotel and the bank. Thank you. Excuse me, how to get to the restaurant? Go straight past the bookstore in the hotel, turn left onto Main Street. It's the second building on the left, between the hotel and the bank. Thank you. So, where is this person going? B. The letter B. What is the, yeah. the restaurant. To the restaurant. Very good. Okay. We're going to have Nubia. You are going to be letter A, Nubia. And Rosa, you are going to be letter B. Y luego you change your words. Please. Okay, teacher. Okay, es teacher. Excuse, excuse me. me. <laughs> when letter B. Well. You. I'm sorry. Hey. Excuse yeah. me, how do you get to the restaurant? Yes. I go uh, go past the hotel in two left on the main street. Go to one block and to the right is across from the train station. Thank you. Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me, Nubia. Me leyó otra que estaba ahí. La tiene que leer con una mano. Excuse me. Hi. Oh, es que no lo... Oh, bien. Excuse me. How do you get on the restaurant? Go oh. street. Go street pass. The book store. In the hotel tour left on to May Street. It's the second building on the left between the hotel and the bank. Thank you. Thank you so much. Very good. We have building. La U aquí no se pronuncia, so vamos con la I. Building. Building. Exactly. Between. 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 Thank you. Very good. Between. Second building. Very good. Thank you. So, the Nubia, ahí me leyó otra Nubia que ese creo que lo había notado aparte. Sorry. Eh? Yes, Lady Wang. Eh, excuse me, how do you get on the restaurant? Or a little bit? <laughs> eh, no, lo que pasa es que en el letter B me leyó el, el de otro. Okay. Ah, sí, 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 es cierto. Yes. Uh, okay. Thank you so much. No problem. No 
problem. Thank you so much. No, yeah. no, that's okay. That's okay. Thank you so much. Very okay. good. Okay, man. Thank you. Get, get. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Give me a minute, please. I'm sorry. Let's get back here. We're going to work with this one. Complete the sentence with the opposite. Okay, we're going to work with the opposite, right? For example, the past office is on the right. It's the Empire State Building is far from here, but the Central Park is. What is the opposite? De la prepositional place. Primero identifiquemos las preposiciones, right? Ah, no, no sé. ¿Cuál es la preposición en la número 2? Uh -huh. ¿Ya? Yeah. On, teacher. Excuse me? On. No, no, en la primera sentence. En la primera sentence, ¿cuál sería la preposición? La sentence desde acá hasta acá. Yes. Go. Ajá. One. What is the preposition here? Or place or preposition of location? Here. Here. Oh, I'm sorry. Here. Very good. I said in a movie. Are you in a movie? Excuse me. From of. What me dijo? Excuse me. In from of. In from of. No. In Paris State Building. Is far from. from. Exactly, far. No te veían los suegros de de Shrek, right? Far, it's far, far away. Okay, so far, far is the preposition. What is the uh, contrary of the far? What is the opposite of far? Mm -hmm. Near station. Oh, excuse me. Near. Wonderful, near. Okay. The Empire State Building. Far. Far from here, but the central park is near here. You can walk there. Very good. Number three, don't walk down Columbus Avenue. Walk. Yes. What is the preposition of place? What is the preposition? What is that? Um, yeah. Up. Mm -hmm. up. Oh, very good. Yes. No. Up. Yes. Up is the correct one, right? Remember that down, yeah, if you go, you walk down, yes, but the opposite, walk up, very good. What about the number four? Mm -hmm. The New London Hotel is in front of the It's mm -hmm. Excuse me? Uh, el London Hotel no está enfrente del banco. Está en. Oh, that means in. In, in, in front. In front of the bank. In front. The new London Hotel in. is in front of the bank. Is in. In it. Behind. Very good. Mire. Yes. Right. Acuérdese que in front of, right, is in front of, but the opposite. Behind. 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 It's behind. Behind. Very good. Behind. Very good. What about the number five? What do we have in the number five? Don't turn left on six. Street. Turn. Right. Yeah. Right. Very good number. Yeah. Perfect. Right. right. Thank you so much. Very good. Um, Eunice, ayúdeme a leer la sentence. Eunice, please. Thank you. Todas? Yes, all of them. Okay. The bus office isn't on the right. It's on the left. The Empire State Building is far from here, but Central Park is near here. You can walk there. Don't walk down Columbus Avenue. Walk up Columbus Avenue. 
the new London Hotel isn't in front of the bank, it's making it down store left or existing street store right. Solo aquí, una recommendation, right? Yes. yes. Eh, espérame, espérame. Okay, I'm sorry. En esta parte de acá, donde tenemos esta letter D y esta consonant, puede unirlo con la pronunciación. It's behind it. It's behind it. Right? So you can, en ocasiones, cuando tenemos una consonante y luego empieza una vocal, lo unimos. Right? En ocasiones. Okay? No siempre, right? But in some cases, we can do that. Teacher. Yes? Teacher. Uh, yes. Far from here or far from here? ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Here or here? Oh, here. 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 Yes, yes. Here. Exactly. Here. It's far from here. Yes, very good. Thank that you. Is, perfect. Perfect. Entonces, um, yeah, so don't forget when, cuando tenemos una consonant y luego un, un sonido de vowel, podemos unirlo sometimes, right? So, um, it's behind it. It's behind it. We can, we can have it like that. Okay. A minute, please. I'm sorry. Okay. Um, let's see. My gosh. My gosh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I would like to show you the following thing because you did a great job today. I love you. You did a really great job. So I would like to show you the following thing. Okay, that means terrific. Bravo. <laughs> Cheers. Okay. Well done. A great job. Okay. Thank you so much for all the job, all the things you did in class. And don't forget to practice your English at home. Practice those little phrases, right, at home. So, right? And also, if you drive, you use a car to go to work. Ponga el, el waste or ponga el, no sé, la cosa que lo lleva las directions, right? Póngalo en English. Sí? Aunque usted ya sepa, right? Donde quedan, donde quedan las, la pupusería, right? Póngalo en English so you can listen. Oh, turn left, turn right, go on. Yes, so you can practice a little bit, right? Yes. Thank you so much, people, for being here. Good night, and we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Thank you. Good Bye -bye. night, teacher. Thanks. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good job. Thank Bye. you. Bye. So Bye-bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Don't forget that. Good night, teacher. Thank you so much. Good night. Take care. Teacher. Yes, Blanca. Teacher. Me, me tomó, ¿verdad? Este, porque no había, no estaba todavía cuando pasó oh, ahorita, ahí la no. lista. Sí, sí. Perfecto. Ya le tomé. Perfecto. Thank you so much. Okay. Very good. Wonderful. Thanks. Good night.